Praise the Lord. Somebody there waiting for a miracle. I said, Praise the Lord. Anybody waiting? I said, Anybody waiting? Power coming upon your life. Are you standing or sitting? Come on now. Stand up and get ready for a miracle. Outside, get ready. A miracle is coming your way. Those counselors don't come back. Stay where you are and stay with them. When those blind eyes open, you are the one to help them come out over here. And when those people begin to get out of the wheelchair and they throw away the crutches, you are the ones to help them to come over here. You brought anybody deaf and dumb. You are the one to, you know, stand by that person. Because somebody is going to get the miracle even now in Jesus' name. Are you ready? I said, are you ready? Because after the prayer, you hear the final amen. You check up yourself and all the load of the devil will be taken away. And every power of Satan broken in your life. Miracle. Everybody shout miracle. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming now. You identify the problem that you have. That's holy Tommy, identify that. Those blind eyes, identify that. Those lame legs, identify them. And then whatever it is, you identify. You raise up one hand and you lay the other hand on your cell. Lay the other hand on your cell. And you raise up the other hand. And then I will pray. When you hear the prayer, you shout it, go to Abuja, Amen. And the power has come down already. And when you hear that final amen, that means it's done. And you check up and I see miracle everywhere now. Are you ready? Father, in Jesus' name, we well, thank you, Lord, because you're still on the throne. And you have promised that there will be the appearance of your glory. There will be the abundance of your glory. Oh, Lord, let it come now in Jesus' name. Where your glory is, there is healing. There's miracle. There are signs and wonders. And there is deliverance. There's resurrection power. And Lord, I pray, let it come on everyone right now. In Jesus' name. I pray that that spirit of insanity and madness come out in Jesus' name. That epilepsy, I command you, come out in Jesus' name. I command that swelling on your body, anywhere that swelling is, in your tummy, at your back, in your neck, and in your legs, I command the swelling, come out in Jesus' name. Lord, I pray for the people that have incurable terminal disease, that cancer, you will dry up. Cancer, I command you, dry up right now. Be healed in Jesus' name. I pray for that ear, that thing that is in the private part. I command that ear be healed in Jesus' name. Asthma, your time has come. Asthma, be healed in Jesus' name. I pray for. You come out in Jesus' name, Lord. I pray for those who are blind. Cataract, you come out. Glaucoma, you come out. I command, be healed in Jesus' name. Blind eyes be opened. Blind eyes be opened and begin to see clearly in Jesus' name. Pain of arthritis, I command you, come out. Paralysis, come out. Stroke, be healed. Lord, confirm the miracle upon every one of them in Jesus' name. 
everywhere now in every pavilion inside and outside miracle inside and outside healing inside and outside deliverance oh lord manifest your glory manifest your power let the anointing that breaks every yoke come upon every life now in jesus name i thank you lord because i know it's done i know it's done confirm it and manifest it lord in jesus mighty name i pray praise the lord it's done you check yourself there because the glory has come down the power is manifested if you are not able to walk before get out of that world chair now you can walk if you brought anybody deaf and dumb, you can check them up. Now they can hear. Now they can speak. And whatever it is you were not able to do before, miracle power is released on you. Do what you were not able to do before. You will see the Lord has touched you. Healing, deliverance, miracle everywhere now. Everybody said amen. You have received, check yourself and come out. Come out, come to the pavilion. You see one right there? Wonders. Please bring them out. Counselors, bring them out. Counselors, bring them out. <laughs> Amen. And everywhere, miracles everywhere, signs everywhere, wonders everywhere. Bring them out, bring them out for testimony. Our counselors, bring them out. Wonders everywhere. Please come out, come out. Bring them out, bring them out. Bring them out. Wonders everywhere. Inside, outside. Please bring them out. Bring them out. Shout of praises everywhere. The Lord has, magni has magnified himself. Bring them out. Our counselors, we are waiting. Bring them to the, to the front of the, uh, of the stage here. Bring them out. Another miracle there. Wonders there. Wonders there. Extraordinary wonders there. Extraordinary wonders. Please bring them here. Bring them out. Don't cross their feet. Just go like this. Amen. Wonders everywhere. Inside, outside. Bring them out. Bring them out. Our leaders, as we have told you, come out, come out for interview. Please bring them out here. Our counselors, bring them out. Check yourself. As all that people are rejoicing, God has touched you as well. God has touched you. Check yourself. We told you. It will be extraordinary wonder. Bring them out. We want to see them. Bring them to the front of the stage. Bring them to the front of the stage. Our group pastor, don't go to anywhere. Just stay here to interview those who are coming. Come out, come out, come out. Let the counselor bring them out. We know wonders are taking place everywhere. Bring them.
We are waiting. We are waiting. Bring them out. Bring them, bring them out. He want to hear testimonies. Another one there. And so many wonders. Bring them out. Bring them out. Because I said, Lord, bring them out. 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 Bring them to the front stage. Bring them to the front of the stage here. Quickly, quickly. Our counselors, bring them out. We are waiting. Bring them out, our counselors. Oh, over there. Another extraordinary one that's there. Please bring them out. Our counselors, bring them out, bring them out. Bring them out quickly. I'll interview them. We'll soon start the testimony. The Lord is mighty here tonight. The Lord is mightily present here tonight. Come out, come out, come out, come out. Another one here. And so many wonders. Counselor, I say bring them out, bring them out. Okay, I can see this woman. I can see this woman coming. Oh, the other, please bring them out. Oh, over there. And so many wonders there. Our counselor will bring them out. Another one there. And so ordinary wonders there. Wonderful. Wonderful. God is great. God is mighty. Come out, come out, come out. Counselors, bring them out. Let the interview, let's interview them so that we can start the, the testimony. Testimony galore tonight. Testimony bonanza tonight. Another one there. Another one there. Everywhere. Signs, wonders, diverse miracles. Interview, interview, interview them. Please quickly. We have short time. We have short time. Interview them on time. Please, please. And let them line up. And they will be coming out to give testimony. Don't go. Your own is there. Check yourself. Check yourself. The Lord has done great wonders in your life. Let me fast, let me fast. We want to hear those spectacular testimonies. Can we start now? Can we start now? Another one there. Everywhere. I believe outside also. Signs, wonders, as we have told you. Extraordinary wonders. Yes, I can see many of you. Please. Please. Let's go quickly, quickly interview them so that we can start the testimonies. The, no, the, the, the first testifier. The first testifier. As we are listening to testimonies, check, your, check yourself and come out. And give God the honor, the glory, and the majesty. Give him the mic. Speak any language you know you can speak well. It's, it's okay, let, it, let us stay there. 
You don't, you don't, don't let her, does he need to climb up? Give her the mic. We want to start the testimony now. Our interviewer, please help us to interview every one of them and let, their, let them line up. Please let them line up. After this, uh, our beloved uh, uh, sister, the next person, the next person, the next person, so that we'll be able to listen to many testimonies before we go. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, we want to use this opportunity to thank God for what he has done for my mother. She has been having leg pain for about four years and now. And in fact, she can't walk without this thing. But through the grace of God this evening and the anointing that overflowed here, now she's okay. I praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The woman who could not walk before, you can see the power of God. The power of God broken the yoke in her life. Another wonder everywhere. Yes, before my mother bought me. Let's listen to testimonies. Please excuse me. Attention, please. Those of us who are singing good, but let's listen to testimonies. Because you are going to give your own testimonies too. Yes. You can continue. Then the people when they come to visit my mother, they went, they see the woman, the woman asked them, say na boy older girl in born. They come tell her say na boy. That's you start happy. Happy, 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 happy. Then go and tell me. They come tell my mother, say give me this your picking. Then can you use in eyes, open my arm for you. can use another, you can use another eyes, open my eyes, yeah. Then you can use in eyes, open my eyes, I remove everything where God gave me. Thank you. What did God do for you tonight? He was born blind. This is a stick used in a walking. But tonight, God opened his eyes. <laughs> Praise the Lord! Don't let him go yet. They will be testing, as we have said. What is this? Paper. Show in color. What is this? My telephone. Praise the Lord! Go and enjoy the blessing of God in your life. Praise the Lord! Somebody that was born after he was born, the two eyes went away. God restored the sight tonight. Praise the Lord! Next testifier. Please go straight, go straight, so that I'll be able to listen to many. Praise the Lord! Praise, 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 Master Jesus! I have been affected of breast cancer for almost two and a half years. I came from Kogi State. So the, a, a member is here that today in this in the service at Great Hope uh, Parish, I cannot use, I cannot dance because of the breast cancer. I came here at the National Hospital. The doctor there, Dr. Olayemi, is my witness, is my doctor there. So this, uh, I was told to wait for this uh, program of our daddy, Kumui. So I waited and I came. So as they were praying, I'm feeling the pain. My sister was there, that we are from the same uh, church. You can see how I'm using the breast cancer for you. from the left hand side. This is it. I cannot dance with it in the morning. A member is there, ask her. So I can dance, I can stipulate. Praise the Lord! I give God the glory 
daddy, God will lift you up more and more. More anointing in Jesus' name. Mm. Thank you all. Next testifier. Cancer vanished away. Don't, don't let her, don't let him climb. It's okay. Give him the mic. Any language you can speak. Sunana Salisu Abdelai Zampareste. Najida Ina Enji Kapana Yadan, Alhamdulillah Yadan. Let's tell him to go straight and tell her what the Lord had done. Yawa Katima Sunajida Ina Jija Tango Dataki, Udani Koi Tamakani. Najija Nago Dataki, among Udani Koi Tamakani. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. The testimony is this. I invited his friend, Kamal. Three of them came in. Kamal invited two, making three. Then I said, hey, Kamal, have you ever heard about uh, Pastor W.F. Kumui? He said, yes. So I said, come, come to sit down with me. I met in the car, public car. Then the next thing, Kamal invited two of them. I said, invited two of them. Kamal never got healing. This man got healing. And he, Look at, he came in like this, three of them. I brought three of them like this. Today, he said, you want to throw this away or give another person? I said, no. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise ye the Lord. Brother, don't let him go yet. Don't let him go. Please, excuse me. Excuse me. Brother Umo. Asked him to explain where he said the three of them came. They were what kind of uh, problem they had before. Let it okay, be clear. What was the problem? Yeah. What was your problem? He was a cripple, and this is what he uses okay. to move around. After the prayer of the pastor tonight, he got up. So he walked to this place on his own, no longer using this. Praise the Lord! Creep who goes up and be walking. Those of you who are far away, a creep who person goes up and be walking. And the thing he has been using to walk before, I mean to crawl before, everything will be discarded away. Praise ye the Lord! Next testifier. Please, please, let's go straight to the testimony. Let's say to that, okay. If you cannot give, another person can help him to give the testimony. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I'm here to testify on behalf of my dad. Um, in January this year, he had an accident in Abuja here, and um, it was very critical. But since then, he has not been able to walk. The surgery was critical. He had a craniotomy surgery because he had an hematoma in his brain. And since then, he has not been able to walk more than probably five meters or take ten steps. But after the prayer tonight, he walked all the way from where the NEMA vehicle is all the way to this side and we have not seen that since January. And Look at the wheelchair up, the person goes up and, and then it's working now. Wait, wait, wait. A, a person that has never walked, you see wheelchair, you can see what he, bro put, it, what he put up, the Lord broke the yoke and he stood up and started walking. Praise the Lord! Praise Jesus! Please, Next testify.
I discovered I couldn't move my body again. From April till date, I'm not okay. able to work. But by the grace of God, when the man of God was praying, I believe in my heart. And today you can see, I can jump, I can run, I can walk. And I said, the Lord who has done this for me, may his name alone be highly exalted in the name of Jesus. Yes, sir. Please, please, let's, uh, let's testify, Pray! please. Please, please, let's be fast. We have short time to conclude everything. Next person now. Praise the Lord! Praise the living Jesus! My name is uh, Sister Rachel Mama. I just came to Abuja 2014. And I've been looking for a child after marriage, married, after I got married. No child. I went to private hospital, general hospital, there's no child. But people will, call, will be asking me, ah, why, they, why are you like this? But I used to tell them, the go God of Pastor Kumuyi will do it. That's what I used to tell them. The God of Pastor Kumuyi will do it. But by the grace of God, that 2014, when Jesus came to Kado, on January, that January, I got pregnant to the glory of God. And I delivered my baby September 24th, 2014. May his name be exalted in Jesus' name. Is this the child? The it's... name of my baby, ah, uh, uh, praise God, it's... love of God. This is the child. Peace of God. Praise the Lord! Praise God! Praise the living Jesus! Sit, but a woman receive a bouncy baby child after the pastor, Pastor Dovu prayed in 20, 2014 when he came here. You can see the child. What you know what God has done for her, the Lord has done for you also tonight. Be expectant. Praise the Lord! The next person, the next person. We have very few minutes to conclude everything. Spectaculars. Let's just give us those uh, spectaculars, extraordinary wonders. Speak, speak, speak. And, uh, What's the term? What? Please, can somebody interpret on time? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. She is saying just some few minutes ago, she had problem with her knee. She cannot walk. But after the prayer of the man of God, today she can walk. She's giving praises to God. Praise the Lord. Uh, this woman could not walk before, but now, after the prayer of the man of God, she can walk now. You can see, without using those uh, walking sticks she has been using before. Be the next testifier, please. Go straight. The Lord is good. Please go straight, My sister. We have a short ago. time. I cannot hear. Oh, my God. All people say that this year is not going to open. I said, by the God's grace, this year must open. I heard that Pastor Kumi is coming in this Abuja. As I must go there, he will heal me. My God will heal me. Now I can, I can hear you people clear. I can hear you. Praise the Lord. I can hear you. I can hear you. Wonderful next one, next testimony, extraordinary wonders. Please give him the mic and let him speak. Don't Praise go straight. The living Jesus. Praise the Lord. Pray, 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 pray
go straight to work there that done for you. There is no time. Thank you very much. I am uh, Brother Ikolodu Oloche from Benue State. I had an incident since last year. So the incident almost killed me. Many people cried, even in my town, my village, that I have already died. So this incident results my new pieces, my belly here burst, of which my intestines show out. Even my forehead, I hate, I hated my forehead on the gutter. What did they God do for you to tonight? Three hospital, three hospitals. The reject doctor ran away. They rejected me. So at last, they, they rushed me to tell Canada. us what the Lord did for the, you tonight. General Hospital, uh, Asokoro. But now I could not see. But now I could see the signing. I could see small, small. I can, I could see. But not clear. I thank God. I give God all the glory for His Majesty. Praise the Lord. Amen. Accident made him to be incapacitated. He, he could not see. The intestine came out, but tonight he could see. Praise the Lord. The next testifier, please. Go straight to what God has done for you tonight. Sister. Go the to Lord your... has done it for me. What? For, for, the ne for the past two years, I've been down. I've been going up and down from hospital to hospital. They say uh, liver enlargement, ulcer, BP. So God has delivered me today of it. As, as I was coming to this program, I couldn't walk. I was just managing to come. They were praying, I was sitting down. They were dancing, I was sitting down. And I love to dance to, to my Lord. So as the prayer was going on, I felt a move in my tummy. The thing just tripped, and that is how God delivered me of all the problem. I, I can move from that place where I was sitting down to this place. I know that the Lord has done it. I received my healings in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord! Yeah, she had problem. She could not. Uh, she had problem with the part of the body because of the problem because of the. Uh, problem that came upon her, but now the Lord has removed everything in her life. Praise the Lord. Please go straight to what God has done for you. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. The Lord is good. In fact, I really appreciate the name of the Lord. For me being here today is a great Testimony. Go straight to what the Lord has done for you. Since I've been hearing that Daddy will be coming down to Abuja to have program with us, I'll be happy to all this. But this morning, in fact, I I don't know how I was like I I couldn't I can't stand up on my home. All my body was everything is heavy me. For me going to short this morning. I forced myself, everything I'll be doing this morning, I forced myself. Even when I got to the church, I, when the pastor was preaching, I can't be able to stay. I went to sleep. It was, I just stand up with faith for the, uh, for the closing prayer. Okay. So when we are now, they, are, they, are, they have gathered to come, I said I must be in this program. The devil will not stop me from coming. And by the special grace of God, I follow them down here. And all the pain I'll be feeling in my body, everything by after the, the minister, after the prayer of the man of God, everything disappear. Praise the living Jesus. Praise the Lord. All the problems in every part of our body vanish away by the prayer of the man of God. Please, please. Those of all who are helping us to interview, people are many, give us spectacular, everyone is spectacular, but let's interview and give all the best. My sister here is very mommy Jimmy, we from National State. She had an accident for three years now. She's, used, she's, she's moving with this thing, but after the prayer, she's now moving. Praise, Praise the Lord! Lord. 14 years, inability to walk, using all these uh, things, you can see the one he raised up. She could not walk for 14 years, but tonight, God raised him up through the prayer of the man of God. Praise the Lord! Praise!
praise the Lord. Uh, please, uh, my name is uh, Chibweze from uh, Imo State. But before I proceed, please go straight to what God has done to for ask you tonight. My, my man, excuse, excuse me, pastor. excuse me, excuse me. We don't have time for those. Give, go straight to what my God has done for is, you. Before I share my testimony, please, I want the pastor to assist me for one reason. I have to lay down before him so that Please. my problem can be permanent forever. He has stroke. My name is Eudeko uh, Dorat. For my papa, I have a partial st st stroke since January. But I can't take a while. But since um, the man of God prays, or I don't know what I Praise the Lord. The woman has stroke. Praise the Lord. The woman has stroke, but the power of God, the anointing of God broke the yoke. The man, the woman has stroke. You can see her walking now. She's perfectly whole. Next testifier, please. Next testifier. Praise the Lord. Go straight, please. Yes, I had an accident in 2012. In 2012. So to today, I came here. They are carrying me come the pharmacy. As the man of God pray, I get up. Begin the work now. I have, I have uh, after the accident, I have a uh, clinic. So I, I feel full confident now. I thank God for Praise this. Praise the Lord. Two years after the accident, he could not walk, but now you can see him walking. Praise the Lord. Next, next testifier. Let's check out of many. Give us few before we close. Praise the Lord. My name is Sister Blessing Sunday. Last year, I am having this pain in my breast. It's very serious pain. I can't even touch it. But when the, when the man of God prayed, the last prayer, I can't even feel anything. Praise the Lord. The pain in the cancer, I mean the pain in the breast, everything disappeared after the prayer of the man of God. Yes, the next testifier. Please, let's go straight to the testimony, what God did tonight. Praise the Lord. This is my father standing with me. Since January now, he cannot walk on his own. He's using this stick to walk. But after the deliverance prayer, he can walk now. Praise. Glory be to the name of the Praise Lord. Praise the Lord. For a whole year, one year, this last year, the, the father could not walk, but now you can see him walking. By the power of the Spirit of God. The anointing of God broke to you. You have received too, and your testimonies also will hear. The next testifier, please. Praise next God. testifier. Praise the Lord. Sometime last year I was diagnosed with motor neuron disease. Inability for me to walk, and I had paralysis from my leg, from my hand, to my head. I couldn't wake up every morning to stand. I needed assistance from my brothers to raise me up. Even when I'm sleeping, I can't stretch myself because of how the disease has paralyzed most part of my body. Even coming to here today, I had to help most of the ushers were the one that helped me and took me to the seat where I got a place to sit down. I want to thank God for the miracle that he has done in my life, for me to have the ability to walk from where I was sitting down, down there, up to this very moment today. I give God all the glory and all the praise. Praise the Lord! For the past one year, since last year, he could not walk. After the prayer, the yoke was broken in his life. You can see him walking. And he will be permanent in your life in Jesus' name. The next testifier. The next testifier. Praise the Lord. 
Praise the living God. By the grace of God, I come with this boy, this young boy that is with me. He cannot speak, he cannot talk. He cannot even hear any sound, even though you throw a stone to him. But now he can hear and he can speak. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Lord. There is a boy here. He couldn't hear. He couldn't, he couldn't talk. But now the Lord came upon him and he could talk now. He could hear by the power of Christ. Praise the Lord. There's testifier. Please, please, let me fast. Pastor, uh, uh, the 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 So now those days, in He could not. It's now working. Praise the Lord. Next testifier, please. Next testifier. My name is Jackson Obona. I had an accident. In two months' time, it will be three years. Today, a man invited me here, and I believe that if I touch here, I will walk without a crutch. This is my first time of walking this distance without a crutch. And I have signed almost 30 to 40 minutes without a crutch. So I believe that God has done it in Jesus. Praise the Lord. He could not walk, but now you can see him walking. See him walking by the power of the Spirit of God through the man of God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. In fact, I thank God what God has done for me. As we have, we have almost reached this camp. For me to just cross and look for the, my invitees, I fall inside a pit. Look at my leg. My baby is no more kicking. I was telling my husband, I said, I should not carry us to anywhere. Oh. I want to come to this ground so that I will lift, I will, I will say the last, even though it's the last hallelujah, God will heal me and my husband. That's why the baby is no more kicking. But the last prayer, as I said, just pray the last prayer. I'm inside that clinic. I just said amen. That amen, I stood up. I said, my husband, let's go and receive that last amen. I'm not going to lie down there. The nurse saw me coming out. He said, what happened? I said, I'm going. And I, what, they walked me in with crutch. I, I fainted. I could not even know what is going on. But I thank God today. Now I can stand. My baby is now kicking. Praise amen. The Praise the Lord. She fell down. A pregnant woman, the baby could not kick anymore, and uh, she could not walk. God performed double miracles in her life. She can walk now, and the baby has started kicking. Praise the Lord! Let's Praise take the fire, please. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Oh, my master said, now January. Let me give God. now. Amen. Among me is testifying that she genuinely she had an accident and she could not be able to walk. But glory be unto the Lord, as 
that as she came here through the prayer of the anointed man of God, after having prayed, now she can be able to walk freely. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. After the accident, she could not walk, but now you can see him walking. Praise ye the Lord. Let's testifier. Let the fast. Let's go straight to what the Lord did tonight. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, this my daughter sustained an injury during a, an accident. So, she could not walk till today as we learned that uh, our father in the Lord is coming. So, I escorted her here and uh, to be the God glory, yeah, she, she walked all the way from where we are sitting down to this place now. Because How long? She cannot walk without this. Uh, when did the accident, when did it take place? It uh, take place at Peggy. At what time? What time? What at, year? Uh, this year, April this year. Okay. April 7 this year. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! The girl that had Thank accident you. April this year, she could not walk since then, but now the yoke has been broken. Praise the Lord! Let's testify, please. Praise the name of the Lord! My name is Bora Shedra Kosiromo. I'm from Niger State, Kotongwa region, from Zion District. I was opportune to be in here in Abuja. When I heard about the program, I said I must attend the program. Not to waste time. I'm a person that always fall and rise, fall and rise. But by the special grace of God, when the uh, Father and the Lord ministered and said that you must give your life to Christ, despite the falling and rising, I said, God, here am I. I was just sitting there. I said, God, Look at me, I will not fall again tonight. Amen. And I prayed earnestly as if I'm, I'm, I'm drunk. I was just praying and praying and praying. At the end of it, light does shine my eye. And I fell down. I said, God, I believe I will not go back to the world again. And today, I'm safe. And I believe that God has, rest, right, has saved me. And when Jesus will come, I will follow him. Praise ye the Lord. Somebody who backslid and he could not, uh, he could not, he could really know what he was doing. He will be rising and falling. But now the power of God came upon him. He has been restored, saved, and by the grace of God, he will never go back anymore. Another miracle there. Another one that's there. Praise the Lord. My name is Gloria Samson from Kualiri, Legion. I just want to thank God for what the Lord has done for me. I had an accident on 24 of March. I was rushed to the hospital lifeless. It was the prayer of brethren that brought me back. Okay. But ever since then, I'm going God. to the hospital for orthopedic. But Still, I'm having pains, and I had re, re fracture. But I, I want to appreciate the name of the Lord for what He has done today. The Lord has done it for me, and I know that it is my relief in Jesus' name. Let's testify, please. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I want to thank God for what you have started in my life. Since 2008, I can't able to stick, but I can able to walk now in fast distance with stick. And I want to give our daddy, the general overseer of deeper life, to continue to pray for me. My name is Brother Taito Sirubochi. So that next time that is coming from Abuja, I will give a permanent testimony. And with our daddy here, Pastor Paul Ayenche, let him pray for me and Pastor Ezra Akanji. I mean, I will give my family testimony. Let's testify.
what did the ghost do to me then this evening? He made me happy. Now at the work, I know crutches. That time at the work, I had the crutches, two crutches. Now I know the happen again. What did the ghost do for me at this evening? I tell God, thank you. Thank, thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord.